You are watching DCMTV. DoubleClickMedia.net. Uh, we came up with a, a solution to actually harvest the rainwater from the gutters of the house and store that in, in a large tank underground. As the water comes from the downspouts, we design a series of pipes to run from the downspouts to the filter boxes where any large debris is taken out of the water. From the pre-filter boxes, the water is cleaned and flows into the tank. Uh, this particular tank is 1,100 gallons in capacity. We have the option to go as large as a 2,000 gallon tank. This is a feature we put on the tank. It is an inch and a half pipe that allows us to insert a measuring stick so the homeowner can test and check the volume in the tank at any time. We are right around 800 gallons. We use a pump station to pull that water out and the pump is constantly under pressure so whenever the valve or the faucet is turned on the homeowner will have eight to ten gallons of water a minute for irrigation with drip tubing or hand water. In the event that rainfall is so much and the capacity of the tank can't handle it, uh, we have a, a safety precaution. It's an overflow system where the water actually goes out a French drain system which was designed to actually stay in the yard and irrigate the landscape so all that water is kept on the site. The main reason we bury a system like this is aesthetics. Uh, simply, it's hidden, it's not noticeable from the road, or most people won't even notice the system is in. We chose to put a mini system in here. I call this our mini cistern uh, solar powered system. This particular system has about 200 gallons of storage. Uh, there's a low voltage pump which pressurizes a water spigot where they can use this for drip irrigation to water their beds. Hand watering can also be done out of this system. The unique thing about this system is it's solar powered. Uh, there's a 12 volt battery and the solar panel ensures that that battery is fully charged. Similar to the larger cistern system, these barrels are buried as well to improve the aesthetics of the area. Once the landscaping is up, these barrels will not even be noticeable. Typical rainwater collection tanks are above ground, very visible, not the most attractive uh, feature to have in the, in the landscape. This one allows you to disguise it, but yet have tremendous capabilities. <laughs>